Ooh, ooh. Hello and welcome back to my Let's Play. I'm your host, Cowl, here on the DCT Experiment server. Thank you for joining me as always. Oh, Jackie slept. Today, as we start out the episode, you can see that we've got the shaders on just to see how things look. Isn't that sunrise beautiful? Yes, like me. But I'm really appreciating everyone that's coming to watch a video, those who've liked and subscribed. If you haven't yet, it would be uh, most appreciated if you could do that. It's been really fun making content for people, sharing, and just generally enjoying Minecraft. Uh, in today's episode, I want to do some stuff here around the farm, and then maybe we'll go look for some villages or diamonds or something, or just build something. I'm not really sure yet, but I'm sure we'll have fun. I'm sure you'll have fun. And let's uh, have a good day. So first things first is let's take a little walk around with the shaders on. This is new since the last video. It's a little perch I got on top of the sheep farm here and over here is where that cave was that we started to dig but never finished uh, the library and whatnot is over there these are where the trees have come from and the bees I think the hive is right there the swamp and the nether portal we can go down inside the roofs here and I'm not exactly sure what should go in here. If you have some idea, let me know. I could maybe throw a farm in here or make it into a living quarters. I, I kind of like this design. I, I tried to start texturing the roof and get all that sorted, but as you can tell, I'm not really great at that. I added some other flower designs to the buildings here with the, the spruce, I believe, and not only the oak. But I really like it. It makes the buildings look like they're smiling flowers. Of course, over here we have the fishing stand and the entrance into the strip mine. Wow, that lighting is just awesome. The pigs. There's nothing really special down over here. I'm really hoping that today maybe we can find a village and pick up some villagers and then perhaps we can get them over here to start auto farming. I would really like to get uh, automatic farming going and hopefully in the future get an iron farm going because I'm pretty iron poor. Once that gets going, I can really start building other stuff. We got quite a bit of bone meal and i think the melons have been going pretty good so i think what we're gonna do is get on our armor grab some food grab a boat and let's go look through the swamp one of the things that i've really been trying to do is work on decorating around not just where the dogs are and all that kind of stuff but having some grass and some flowers it's been really hard for me. I'm not exactly sure how to do that. Uh, I got rid of the extra sheep and we just have the cows here for leather and all that sort of stuff. I guess I need to start collecting milk at some point. We're over here near the nether portal and the back side of the barn. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna pop a boat down and we're gonna go see what we can find. So I'm sorry, I had to turn the shaders off because they were just too pretty and I couldn't focus on what I was doing. I'm going to pop some of these lily pads, I guess, as I go through here. I've not been out here, so I'm not entirely sure what's in this swamp. Oh, doesn't this take us back to when I got lost after messing up the nether portal? Oh, oh, ooh, ee. Let's see if I can hit all of them. Oh, yeah, I definitely can if I'm not looking where I'm going. Bamboo. Sugar cane. Can I go anywhere else? 
without getting out. We're just going to have to park this boat and walk. That is so weird. What is this? Is that a floating mountain cave? Wow, that is wicked. I don't think I've ever seen anything like that before. I gotta ask somebody to sleep because I didn't bring a bed with me. I'm sorry, sheepies, it's for the good. I didn't get enough wool. Not enough wool. <laughs> dig, 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 dig. Yeah. So that was scary. Whew, better. Um, nighttime. I forgot to make a bring a bed. So I guess let's do that right now. I don't have enough wool of the same color. Ugh. I can't make like a gray bed. So yeah, I guess I'm just going to have to wait it out until it's morning time and then I will be back. Okay, so I didn't feel like waiting. So I went out and I found a skeleton, which means we should be able to take bone meal and make white dye and do this and make white wool and make a white bed. So yeah, that was, that was scary. Um, probably should think that through a little more the next time I go adventuring. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> All right. So let's have a, a little more fish. There's some EXP. Wow. This, this is really weird let's get up to the top of this mountain and then see what we can see hmm 
Hmm. I think I should probably head back toward the base so I don't get too lost now that my spawn point is set out here. I probably should get some more food while I'm at it. Sorry, cows. YOLO. Ooh -hoo. Have to keep my eye out. I'm currently looking. Ooh. But I, oh. Oh, oh. I'm looking for. Pumpkins and cocoa beans as well as stuff to make green dye I think we found a village It's a giant mushroom Wow All right, hello there village I wonder if there are any villagers. Uh oh, doors are open. That does not make me feel good. Hello? Hello? Let me shut these up. This way I'll know I've been in it. Sorry for future people who come if this is all empty. That's empty. Oh. Empty. Fish break. What is that? Smooth stone. Okay. I think they have cleaned this village out. What happened here? But we just give them all a little shot here. This one. All gone. It's a lot of diorite. There's somebody in there. Oh. There's a villager in there. I already check all these. Yeah. Oh, here they are. I guess somebody was keeping them safe. All right, all right, all right. Does that mean there were villagers here? Hmm, who knows? All right, so I guess somebody has kind of claimed these. I think this villager is the dumb one. Ouch. There's a bed. I'll take it. What's up here? Get another bed. I don't really need these as I have like a crazy wolf farm, but before too much scary stuff comes, let's uh, get ourselves to sleep. All right, so there are villagers. They're just in here. How many? Two. Hmm. All right. So what biome are we in? What biome are we in? We are in planes, Minecraft planes. I'm going to do some quick research and I will be right back. Okay, so I did some research and it turns out these guys are nitwits, which means they can never have a job and they can't trade. So I can breed them, which means I could maybe get a baby villager. Uh, that's not great news, but 
there is three of them here so that's a lot of nitwit maybe i'm gonna try to find my way back to my base and we'll see if we can't get them some food maybe carrots potatoes or wheat and breed them up well i'm back here at the village and i have a bunch of beds because i heard i need those and some bread and carrots to give these guys so first let's get the bed set up because i think they won't do anything well that's kind of scary unless a bed is available all right so that can be three <laughs> four and i guess let's just put another one in here five all right so hey guys you hungry There you go. You guys want some privacy? Is that it? I wonder if the bed needs to be more nearby. Let's block this door off. They do sleep. That's good. I guess I need more bread. So let's get that made. So upon further review, it looks like I may have given all my carrots to one guy. He got angry that he couldn't breed. Because they're a little dumb. A little, little, a lot dumb. But... I'm gonna have to call it here for today because it's really late and I think I'm gonna bring some food and log back in tomorrow and try this again. See you in a second. Alright and welcome back. Um, I'm oh, a little hungry. We've had some success. We pop over here and we look inside. We have ourselves a little villager. Hey there buddy. Yes, you. Hello. So now the next thing to do is to find a way to get the baby villager out and then somehow moved to our base. So I'm going to walk around and see what I can do. All right, so let's see if we can get the little guy to come out here and into this little cubby I've built. Oh, I did not know he could do that. Whoops. I'm going to wait here for a minute and see if I can't get this guy to come out of this little hole. Hello there, little one. Success! Woo now to get this guy back over to the base.
So I broke the boat to let the guy out. And it turns out that was not a good idea. Uh, he immediately took off. I needed to sleep. And when I found him, he was in here. So now I've got two idiots and a big guy. And I'm going to have to find a better way to deal with getting them out of here. But I'll save that for another time. All right, so I'm over here at the base and a little bee. Sorry, didn't mean to pull you up here. Um, yeah, like I said, I'm up here at the base and I'm thinking about how can I get the villagers over here to this base. So I want to look at how many rails do I have. And if we look in here, I've got 39 normal rails and two powered. I can make more power rail, but I think what this means is we've got to go back to the mine shaft again. Oh no. Uh. Anyway, I'm going to get my gear on and I think I'm going to try to make it down to the mine shaft and see if we can't pick up some rails. Maybe we can find some iron along the way. All right, here we go again. Hopefully we can find something good and some rails. That didn't feel good. Apparently there's some skeletons outside. So I hate to say it, but I think the video this week will be very short. Um, I did do a lot of farming and I got a lot of stuff, but apparently my computer is not happy and the graphics are doing not great and there's something wrong. I was able to go down into the caves and I got a whole bunch of iron, some carts, I got some pumpkin seeds, which is great. We'll be able to do a pumpkin and a melon farm now. And we got a whole bunch of tracks so that we can hopefully try to go and get some villagers from a town that I found. But I think that's going to be it for this week's episode. I just want to say, hoo -hoo. thank you for joining me. Like and subscribe. And hopefully we'll have a better episode next time. Thanks and bye.